The brand new update of Fortnite just dropped and it revealed a ton of crazy stuff. We got some crazy map changes, but not only that, we got a trailer for the end of the season event, the destruction event. Now, before we get into it, guys, if you think it would be awesome to have no school Friday, so we get a full three day weekend to just fully relax. If you think that'd be cool, leave a like on the video, but be fast. But yes, guys, we got a bunch of different stuff to go over today. Of course, we're going to be covering the new event, the new map changes with C Secrets, but we're also going to be going over some fun glitches, some secret spots on the map, and even a secret item you can unlock. But speaking of which, guys, if you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe. It only takes a second, and over 80% of you are not subscribed, which is still crazy to me. Let's fix that. And then for the skin on last video, it was the Joker. So here's a ton of people that got that right. And this time around, let's go with this skin here. So comment down below if you know the name of it, and I'll leave hearts on a bunch of the ones that get that right. Yo, hold on a second. This is just kind of a bonus thing, but look at how far underneath the ground this tent is. Wait a second. I got an idea. Oh my gosh. If we claim this abandoned tent, we can then, or can we not? I wanted to see if we could like sleep inside of it because then we'd be like under the ground. Oh my gosh. I just saw it there for a second. Yes. The menu showed up. All right. We're going to click rest and then... Are we underneath the map? Yo, I can't tell. Oh no, somebody's running by. They definitely don't see us over here though. So that's good. What happens if we stop resting? Yo, <laughs> bro, I'm underneath this like gravel here. What the, there's a chest under here as well. Well, an ice chest, but what in the world? Did we just discover a glitch? Oh my gosh, I didn't actually expect that to work. That's hilarious. It's not one that's really repeatable. You gotta have this tent just perfectly spawn underneath the gravel, but that's crazy. We're underneath this hiding spot right here and it actually goes quite a ways. This is kind of cool. You can go all the way around the edge of this right here and then go all the way back this way. And wait a second, I guess we could maybe escape if we claim this tent, but I don't know. I kind of like my secret spot right here. Oh, no. And we escaped. Nice. <laughs> Uh-oh. And now I'm stuck. Now I'm stuck. What happens if I use a shockwave grenade? Oh my gosh, it worked. <laughs> but now guys, let's hop into it with some of the brand new event stuff because so much is going on right now. Let's start off with the more obvious stuff before getting into the more secretive leaked stuff. But like we got to check out the brand new location and the secret secrets that you probably don't know are even there. So here we go, hopping out of the battle bus. We got to check out this area. Oh my gosh, this area has already changed up so much. That's for sure the doomsday device too. That's crazy. Oh my gosh, that looks more insane than I thought it was going to. What happens if we like fly into it? Oh my gosh, it launches us away. So it's called the collider too. That's interesting. So what is it colliding with? Like what is the purpose of this device? It's clearly hard Harnessing energy similar to the stuff we featured in my last video. Definitely check that out if you haven't yet. But we can glide super far with this as well. Oh my gosh, this is actually a really good rotation spot. <laughs> but yeah, I like that when you fly into it, it like launches you away. And then like check that out on the map right there. Why does it show up as like a separate entity on the mini map? Like if we zoom in here on the main map, yeah, the size of the collider, there's like a symbol for it, but it changes. Why is that? That's so weird. Oh, Okay, well, uh, oh no, there's a player over there. We gotta be a little bit careful here. Oh, that wasn't very careful. <laughs> we survived though, let's go. I'm curious what else is around here. Oh my gosh, there's a scanner here. That's a bit of a secret. So we can scan for other players and chests in this area. Yo, okay, there is a lot of people in this spot. I mean, I'm not surprised it's brand new, but still. But yeah, there's gotta be even more secrets explaining some of this. I mean, we've got leaks and stuff to cover as well here, but let's see if we go up into this area. This is just mechanical mechanical stuff to help with the collider. What about this? There's a screen up here. Doesn't seem to be showing anything about the uh, actual collider itself. Just shows some random tanks that aren't even connected over here. I'm still curious though. Like what about inside of some of these other buildings? Oh, there's jetpack spawner too. That's pretty cool. So, I mean, we found like a bunch of other secrets, but nothing about the collider. It looks like we're maybe going to have to look for more info on that later. Yo, and oh my gosh, it's Huntmaster Saber as well. He spawns over over in this area now. This spot has got a lot going on, honestly. Now then after that, guys, I've got a couple of glitches to show you before we hop into the teaser trailer that Fortnite just released for this brand new event. So first things first, we need to find a couple of items. 
So let's see here. Just keep opening up these chests until we... Where is this chest? In the ceiling. Come on. Yes. And no, not the item we need. Oh, sweet. Here we go. We got some balloons. That's one of the first items that we need. And then where is the next one here? We need a lightsaber. Yes, finally. Obi-Wan's lightsaber. All right, let's go. So this first glitch is pretty small. Basically, all we need to do is use a balloon or two and then pull out our lightsaber and it'll cause our character's legs to look very odd. <laughs> what are you doing to a fish? Why? Okay, yeah, that definitely works pretty well. <laughs> I don't know why his legs like just don't want to work with the balloon. That's crazy. He's looking like a spider or something. I don't know. But as I've said, we've got another glitch to test out here, which requires us to grab this truck here. Oh my, please let me go. No, no, no. Don't run into that person. All right, I think we're good. I think we escaped the person behind us. But yeah, this glitch is even better than the previous one because if we bring this truck up to an area like right around here, this should work fine. And then also bring out some shield bubbles, which they just added back recently. All we got to do is line it up with the side of the truck right about here, throw the shield bubble and then drive the truck. And oh my gosh, it is starting to freak out. Yo, we're like launching across. Bro, the truck is freaking out because the shield bubble is like somehow attached to the wheel. Yo, oh my goodness. It just continues to keep getting launched into the air. No, <laughs> that actually worked pretty well for like moving faster across the map. But all right, let's try that again right here. I don't know if it works better if you throw it like right above the wheel, but like right about here. Okay, that seemed like a pretty good one as well. It's definitely... Okay, this one's not working quite as well. But you saw that first time we did it, the car was like getting launched across. Now it's just spinning around and looking really weird. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love Fortnite glitches. But now guys, let's get into it with the stuff that has to do with the brand new teaser trailer for this brand new event, the destruction event. Basically over on Fortnite's Twitter account, they just put up this tweet right here, which says arise. And then with it, a 16 second video that reveals some very intriguing stuff. So I'll play this for you first and then we'll discuss the secrets inside of it. So yes, guys, a very mysterious trailer, honestly. But let's get into the interesting stuff. The main one, the more obvious one, is the fact that we see Mecha Team Leader's face <laughs> just fully at the end of the trailer. Basically confirming that that whole entire mech is in fact going to return for this brand new event. Now, how that exactly is going to work? Are we going to be using it to battle against the IO? I mean, obviously, that's probably what they're implying. But what exactly are we going to be battling against? Just IO4? Forces? The Collider? I mean, there's still a lot of questions to ask there. The other interesting thing I noticed within this trailer maybe isn't the biggest piece of info, but you hear a voice say crew to battle stations, implying that this is going to be a huge battle that we're actually going to be taking part of. In the previous event that Mecha Team Leader was on the map when she fought the Devourer, we just kind of sat around and watched. But this seems to imply that we're actually going to be doing more to help Mecha Team Leader in this fight, which sounds so cool. But does that also mean we'll see the return of the Devourer? That's a good question, and we're probably going to have to talk about that in the near future. But then after that, guys, it looks like we can unlock a brand new item that's kind of a pretty interesting item. Also, Fall Guys, we'll have to talk more about that sometime. But this one right here, we know that the LEA skin got announced, but something that's more secret, it says that we can unlock a special item by completing a quest in this map. And then here we go. Let's see if we can get this special item. I'm not even sure how to do this. Oh, geez. I probably should have grabbed a weapon, though. That would have helped, right? <laughs> okay, guys. So I think I figured it out. I think we need to get 15 eliminations in order to unlock this special item. Whoa, buddy. What are you doing? Why are you throwing so many just random builds? No, this is my elimination. Yes, got him. Okay, wait. No, we have to get a 24. Five eliminations? Bro, people are so tryhard in this mode too. That's gonna take forever. Have grenades, buddy. Come on. No, how did none of those hit? Oh, there's one. Yes, there's another one. Let's go. Everybody's just standing right here. I need more grenades. Yes, the grenades work. There's another elimination. All right, we're making good progress. Grenades, come on. Yes. Oh, check this out. Oh my gosh, we're going off. Yo, triple kill. 20 eliminations. We're almost there. One more elimination. That's all we need, guys. This spot is actually like OP. Hello. 
Oh gosh, I missed. Come on, one more elimination. Yes, we got it. So there we go. We completed the challenge and that is going to unlock us the brand new spray. Yes. And let's see it. There we go. The LEA was here spray. After all that work, we finally got it. Was it worth it for just a spray? I don't know, but it's cool. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, be sure to subscribe as well as turn on notifications for more fun videos coming up soon. On top of that, be sure to check out some of my previous videos on the screen right here, such as going over a bunch of info about map changes and even more about this event. But again, I hope you enjoyed today's video and I'll see you in the next one.